Listen, one of them will have to go. I, I, I honestly believe that. For me, Mitch Marner is more of a complete player than Willie Nylander. He may not be as totally naturally talented as Willie, and everybody needs a Willie Nylander. Uh, in the lineup, but not to the exp expense where, you know, you've shortchanged your blue line. I, I would keep Mitch Marner. But in saying that, too, I really believe that with Mitch Marner and two years left on it or one more year left on his deal, he might b bring you a higher return if you traded him. He might bring one or two top four defense. He might bring you top blue chip prospects. I, I think I think the package to get more back is in the hands of a Mitch Marner than it is a Willie Nylander. But for a 200-foot mm -hmm. player, the, the one that has a conscience for being third man high or coming back hard to defend, for me, it's Mitch Marner all day long I want to keep.